Okay, so I'm reviewing the Acorns Investing app today and I can tell you right now that this is not going to be your typical review of the Acorns app. I will be talking about Acorns and certain aspects of it, so some of that you're going to see as being the same, but I can tell you right now, after having signed up for Acorns, I have a completely different uh, feeling about it and that's what I'm going to share with you today. I am not a financial expert. I'm just like everyone else when it comes to investing. I do the best I can and hope for the best. So everything I'm going to tell you today is just going to be my opinion. I want to stress that if you know anybody that needs to and start investing now, I hope you share this video with them because take a look at this. You can see the earlier you start investing, how much of an impact that makes in your ability to grow your personal wealth. The Acorns Investing app is for anyone, but it is specially designed for the beginner investor. Something like Acorns helps you get comfortable with the idea of investing. It gets you started earlier rather than later. You can see this individual here where she started out pretty early. She expects in the not too distant future to be a millionaire. And this is just a regular everyday person. Acorns is considered a micro investing platform, which means with the word micro is that you don't have to put a lot of money into it at all. Investments are at the lowest only five dollars. Five dollars to get you in the game of investing. If you have this misconception that you need hundreds or thousands of dollars to establish and keep an account running an investment account that is completely false. You can start today even if you have only a part-time job and if you have limited income, you can start an Acorns account. It only costs $5 to start. Every investment after that is as low as $5. This is a game changer. This allows just about everyone from any walk of life to be able to get into investing and building positive income for their future. I'm going to be very honest about this review because some people think, well, some people do these reviews and they say, well, you know, you put this, you put $50 a month for 30 years and look how much money you have. But the reality I'm going to share is that things happen, things come up, and having a source to be able to use to help when times are difficult is really ideal. And this is why I think Acorns is really good. This is a point that I don't think other reviewers of Acorn, Acorns really um, concentrate on but Acorns is an excellent way to set up an emergency fund. If you have the correct mindset, you're not going to use Acorns money to go on a vacation to the Caribbean. You're going to leave that money there. But if you anytime have an emergency, like maybe emergency dental work, maybe the bill's $2,500, you cannot avoid that because you have to take care of that. You're in a lot of pain. From what I've seen from an example like this, when people are in a situation like that where they have to come up with thousands of the dollars for an emergency expense, that is the starting point of credit debt. I talk a lot about credit debt. A lot of what I do on this channel is how to improve your credit history. I know the stories. I know how everything was fine and then something happened and then your credit score was tanked in the low 500s. Now, when you have a situation like that, say with like a dental bill or something like that, 
that could be thousands of dollars and you're not going to have to put that on a credit card or anything like that you could use your acorns account as an emergency fund now keep in mind anytime you sell an investment and you take a profit on that investment there are tax implications this, is, this will become a taxable event but a lot of people can use something like this as a way to avoid high compounding interest rates on their credit card later okay so there's different levels of investing on acorns you have five different choices available to you from the most conservative to the most risky the more conservative choices are going to be based more on bonds and the most risky are going to be based more on stocks i actually chose the riskiest level which is only investing in stocks they're going to make a suggestion for you and they did make an investment suggestion that i need and should invest in this mid-level category but i decided to go with their most aggressive option which is only investing in stocks the way i look at it is they're investing my money in about a hundred different stocks they're going to buy and sell those stocks and they're going to be keeping a close eye on how these companies are doing so sure some of these companies over time can fail but overall they're going to make educated decisions on what stocks to buy for me at what they perceive to be the best times so this is really a good point here that i'm making is that if you have no interest in setting up your own stock account and buying 100 shares here 10 shares there and hoping for the best you don't have to have that stress with acorns they do all of that for you they're making educated decisions on what they think are going to be good stocks that are going to grow for the future but remember they make a suggestion for you you can always go into the settings and change that to more conservative or less conservative the really cool thing about acorns is that you have different options in making investments you could do a one-time investment a reoccurring investment or something they call roundups roundups will basically take the purchases you make and round it up so if you make some purchase for ten dollars and fifty two cents they will round that up to $11. So essentially 48 cents goes into a little uh, account. Once you hit $5, that $5 gets deposited into your Acorns investing account. This can help you over time take the spare change you have and help you put that into an investment vehicle that will compound. So the nice thing is, if times are good, you can put $50 down a month reoccurring, $50 or more. But when times are harder, you can reduce that as low as $5. And still, if that's still not low enough, you can shut off reoccurring altogether. So in this way, even though you're not adding any more money into your account, it still is continuing to grow keep in mind when you sign up they're going to try to set you up on the three dollar a month plan you can before you sign up for acorns you can hit that little uh, hyperlink and where you can compare the plans and you can then go in and choose the one dollar a month plan that is what I advise people to do again the uh, other plans could be beneficial for some people if you're finding this review today on the Acorns investing app helpful, I'd appreciate so much if you could hit that like button. Make sure, again, to share it with your friend if it could help them to start investing. And if you want to see my upcoming videos, don't forget to subscribe. One of the things that some people have done, and I've seen this in the reviews I've watched, they actually take out some of their Acorns money the investments that they earn through acorns and they reinvest it into something else whether that is um, in another fund or they put it into the stock market if you want to go on to the next level investment 
of investing, you might want to consider investing in a stock in the stock market directly by having your own account. And for that, I recommend Weeble. Weeble is a great app to invest with because there are no trading fees. Back in the day, you were charged when you bought stock and when you sold stock. I have also signed up for Weeble and I will be doing a review on Weeble. But what they did for me is they gave me in total four free shares of stocks. I got two shares for signing up and two shares for depositing $100. So simply by signing up, they gave me two shares of stock. These stocks were um, under $3. And after I deposited $100, I got these stocks that were just under $12. And as you can see, I got one share of Ford stock. So after depositing $100, I got a value of about $30 in stocks. That was a 30% return on my investments, technically speaking. But I intend to keep these stocks, but from what I hear from other people, they can actually, in, in a short amount of time, they're able to sell those stocks. People have been able to acquire four shares of stock simply by opening a Weebles account and funding it with $100. So if you're interested in doing that, I also have a link in the description below that will help you get your stocks. Keep in mind, this is the promotion at the time of the filming of this video. They will change their promotions. They will either um, be not as good as this one. So if you like this one, make sure you take advantage of it. Or maybe it's possible that at a later date, they could have even a better promotion. Okay, so have you tried any of these apps, these micro investing apps, or maybe you have an app that helps you buy stocks. If you've used any of those, make sure you leave a comment in the description below. So now you know a very easy way to start investing at any income level, at any experience level, using the Acorns app. I really do hope you take advantage of this offer. Take advantage of the link I have in the description below. You'll get that $5 bonus just for signing up with your first deposit as low as $5. If you like my video today, make sure you like and subscribe if you want to see more. And if you want to learn more about how to improve your credit, make sure you check out these videos here. Thank you so much and I'll see you next time.